my clock, I can't stop. Fuck around, make my 40 pop. No pop kind, I pop pistols. What did you, YouTube? Today, I want to tell you guys a story. And it's a, or a story that some of you might know. Um, but it's a story of happiness, but overwhelming sadness at the same time. So, in this video, we're going to talk about Fortnite. And Fortnite was a weird game when it first came out. It was a Battle Royale game that was following up of one of the biggest games to come out at the time. PUBG. PUBG was so massive. And Battle Royales were definitely not really even thought of as a thing until PUBG came out. Now, yes, yes, H1Z1 was relevant, but PUBG did it so much better. Uh, and that, I know that's a matter of opinion, but we're going by with what the masses were saying at the time. So don't jump down my shit too much. But, but we got that. And then, and then we have another situation where Fortnite comes along. And this, there's this failing company that, or they, they put out a game that just wasn't capturing people's appeal. And they said, oh, okay. Okay, well, you know, come up with something. It took a month of time. Yes, a month. And they put together one of the biggest gaming phenomena in, in, in gaming history. Like, it was crazy. It's definitely one of the most popular games of all time. It, hit, it caught on like wildfire. It, it, it had... It had people from all demographics, you know, playing the game. And it became so big. And it filled everybody. Even if they didn't want to admit it at the time, with a sense of childlike wonder. Wondering what item was going to be in the shop. Wondering how rare something was. Wondering what the next update was going to be, you know? But then, it did so well and it peaked and it launched so many careers and then all of a sudden, it went for a loop. It just kind of went downhill. They started to add vehicles. Yeah. You know, the, the shopping cart was okay. The the ATV was okay. The even 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 the uh, the golf cart was okay. But they started to add more ways to become mobile around the map. Started started reducing, you know, how much you can build with. Started nerfing weapons to the point that they don't really do as what, what they should do. And they almost completely changed the game. And this is really sad because... No matter how much people screamed, you're losing your player base. You're losing, you're losing your veterans. They kept changing it to make it more appealing to the people that were playing the game. The, P, the casual players. And now, skip forward to Season 7. You know, we're not going to go over all the things in the past. You know, all the all the, 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 the nerfs, all the, the things that, you know, irritated me in the past. We're going to skip to Season 7, and we're going to talk about that. We're going to skip to boom boxes. Why? We're going to skip to planes. Why? And then, not once, well, once in Season 6. They had this this uh, world event, I guess is what you can call it. A world event that spawned in zombies to the single player. So not only are you directly affected by the fact that there are, if you are too close to a spawn, a zombie spawn. Shoutouts to Minecraft. If you're too close to a zombie spawn, your building gets broken. If you're too close to a zombie spawn in the middle of a fight, you have zombies beating on you. 
And so you're taking extra damage as well as you're having people. So you have no choice but to focus on one or the other. I don't know in what mentality they thought that this was a good idea. Whether it be season six or whether you thought it was a good idea to hype up recycled content for your player base. Now, there are a lot of games coming out this year. There are a lot of games coming out this year. And one of the biggest things that you should not be doing is adding in things to make it even more un unenjoyable. That's the word. It's not even a sense of it's not this is just sheer disappointment at this point. You gave you hyped up an event. Now mind you, if you guys saw the beginning of this video, the gameplay in this, the, the the gameplay of it, seeing the giant ice king come out of the clouds, you know, the the the, the snow come across. Cool, but the actual event very 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 lackluster. This this doesn't come from a sense of, oh, you did this, and now I don't like this. It's more of a sense of a progressive amount of things that you've done that prove that you don't care about your player base, not your at least older player base, and that it's all... Because what I see when I see these zombies is I see, oh, hey, that's at least something to shoot because I'm going to die to an actual player. So at least I can shoot these things and feel like I'm doing something. That's what I see. Now, uh, yeah, if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But that's 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 what I see. I don't know what to say, guys. I I really don't. There's like I said, there's tons of games coming out this year, and right now, I feel like they almost have such a big head at this point that they feel like they can do whatever they want to to make more money. Either that, or they know it's ending. And they know the hype is ending. And they're trying to squeeze out that little bit of money. They're trying to squeeze out that little bit of people that they can bring into the game to make them a little bit more money. I, I don't know. But you guys make sure that you guys tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. I'm very curious. And if you guys like the video, make sure you guys leave a like. Make sure you guys uh, subscribe to the channel as well as clicking the bell to be notified on all my future content. And I don't know. Maybe this video will get traction. Maybe somebody will see it. Maybe they'll actually listen. Probably not. But with all that being said, till next time, I'm out of here. Peace.